Now, Google is getting involved in a new search, the search for alternative energy sources. It's announced plans to invest more than $10 million in renewable energy projects using the Earth's hotspots to generate electricity. Mackie Lake is in New York with that story. Deep pockets and deep drilling. Google's plan is to invest millions into new geothermal energy technologies that could one day transform how the U.S. heats its homes and offices. Here's what's getting Google so excited. Up till now, most geothermal energy has been generated from tapping into naturally occurring hot spots like geysers and hot springs. Iceland, which sits atop a number of these hot spots, gets much of its power this way. But not everyone can tap into a geyser. And that's where the new geothermal technology that Google is backing comes into play. With this technology, called Enhanced Geothermal Systems, or EGS, engineers can drill wells deep into the earth close to molten rock. They inject water near these hot rocks to make steam, and that steam translates into clean power. A map of the United States shows that there are a number of areas in the West with hot spots close enough to the surface to be tapped for geothermal power generation. Experts say done correctly, this technology could make extensive contributions to U.S. energy needs. Geothermal energy has major potential that hasn't yet been tapped, but it looks like we're poised to start to actually unlock that now. A recent study last year by MIT, sponsored by the Department of Energy, suggested that geothermal energy could provide as much electricity as nuclear provides today. So about 20% of our electricity needs could be uh, supplied by this relatively clean uh, and ultimately we think it can be a low cost and competitive source of electricity. Now $10 million is small change for Google, which sits atop hordes of cash, but experts say the funding will give this tiny industry a big boost. For one thing, it matches the total amount of money the U.S. government is investing in geothermal research. It should also be noted that this is just one of a number of alternative energy projects that Google is now funding. Under a Google Energy Initiative announced last year, the company plans to sink tens of millions of dollars into solar power and wind power initiatives as well. Ten years since its founding, Google is not only making a lot of green, but it's showing a greater commitment to going green. We'll have to see if that investment pays off. Maggie Lake, CNN, New York.